we're the only ones here at the moment. All the other pitches are empty. It's just us at the moment. Beautiful, aren't they? Dean Castle used to be Kilmarnock Castle. Guess where we are? Any clues? Welcome to the channel. We are Graham and Ellie. We are Wizard in the Wild. You join us today on our way to Orkrani for our last night on Arran. Well, we're back at base camp, aren't we darling? Aye, we are. I've got my book that Kat, one of our daughters, let me have. It's called The Wild Water Woman. Oh, that's us for now, isn't it, darling? Yes. For the next few hours, editing, reading, dogs. sleeping, sleeping. Graham's busy editing. I'm going to cook a curry. So to the high trick pot, I've added green beans, uh, broccoli, sweet corn, and carrots. And then I'm going to add a patax plant-based lentil tikka masala. And on top of that, I'm going to do just whole grain rice and quinoa. But this looks all right, Gray. Look, I think that will taste quite nice. Got lots of veggies. Well, you can't and... tell from a picture, can you? You no. need to get it in your gob and on your tongue, then you'll know what it tastes like. <laughs> get on with Go it. Go on in, put it in, stick it in. This isn't staged at all, is it? Come on, get it in. To the actress. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Nice? No, it's good. Good curry. Right, I'm going in. I'm turning this Dig off because I'm Dig going in. in. Well, here we are at the Orkrani motorhome stop. This is our last morning here today. We're off shortly to go and get the ferry. At Brodick, yes. Yeah. So how do you feel it's been? Oh, we've had a fantastic time, haven't we? Yeah. Um, it's been really, really nice. Always lots to see that we, we haven't been able to see and do, so we have to come back again. We're the, um, we're the only ones here at the moment. All the other pitches are empty. It's just us at the moment. Isn't it? it is. Yeah. And I thought it was because you said you smelt nice, but I think you've <laughs> driven them off, darling. Right. we better get packing. I've got yep. my washing up to do. And we've got a ferry to catch. We have. Dogs to walk. Uh, our last walk before we go to the ferry port. And it's raining. Don't know if you can see that, but it's the first rain that we've had since we've been on our run. Off to the ferry. Hello there. What did you say, lane four? Lane four, yeah. It's the big one or the little one again. And here comes our ferry. It's the little one again. Not as comfortable as the other one. Bit of a squish. Yeah, last again. We do have to be quite good drivers here. So this lovely lady looks like she's going to keep jazz. <laughs> Come my best friend. Yeah, best friend. Look at that. She's definitely got the right vibes going on there. No, she's very friendly, isn't she? But she definitely likes this lady a lot. Yeah, she does. Yeah, I forgot to take. She's coming home with you, yeah, definitely. She's a little rescue. We've only had her a couple of weeks. Oh, she loves a cuddle. We'll leave you with these. Yeah, we'll just go and have a coffee. Is that all right? <laughs> we had a funny experience when we parked up on the ferry. We got up to the top of the stairs and someone opened the door for us and we thought, very nice man who works on the ferries, and he watches our channel, we couldn't believe it. He didn't want to be on the camera, unfortunately, so we couldn't film him. But he says, I always do that. I check out camper vans, and if they've got a channel, I watch their vlogs. If this get, makes it to the vlog, and you're watching it, you'll know who you are. 
because you opened the door for us to let the dogs in. So thank you. So we're just pulling into Morrison's for some LPG and diesel. We met subscribers Ian and Julie Scott. They are caravan and motorhome wardens with a quirky taste in slippers. Nice to meet you guys. We leave Morrison's with our lunch and head for Dean Castle. Dean Castle Country Park. The country park is free and is one of Ayrshire's top attractions. It's open daily. This picture shows Dean Castle after a devastating fire reduced it to ruins. It was restored in the 1900s by the 8th Lord Howard de Walden. We're going to have a quick look round and let the doggies stretch their legs. The Dean Castle grounds are really lovely for a stroll around and if we had time we'd go into the uh, cafe. The castle was originally known as Kilmarnock Castle, but this sign could do with a bit of a clean up. There are lots of traditional breeds of farm animals on the estate. We got to see these fallow deer. Some deer? That's why it's all fenced off, I did wonder. Oh look, they're all sleepy. Right, we're going to hit the road and get to our park up for tonight. where we are. Any clues? You don't know, do you? Well, some of you might. I you think a few of you have been here before. Definitely. A few people we follow on YouTube have been here and had a good time, haven't they? Are you going to put them out of their misery? We are at, at the, the Kelpies. Kelpies. Um, little bit of confusion. I thought you had to pay for this car park and there's nowhere here you can pay, so we went up to the other car park, there's nowhere there you can pay. Didn't want our money. So I walked to the visitor centre, which was supposed to be closed, but luckily I managed to find a door and got in, and asked the lady and she said it's free at the moment because it's the winter, mm. and there's nobody doing that job. Oh, well that's good. So we're staying here till, what, end of March? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're here for a month until they start charging. <laughs> Unfortunately, it started raining. Yeah. We can't really complain because it's the first rain that we've had since we've been away. Mm, on our trip. So uh, we've been pretty lucky, haven't we? We have. We have. And um, seeing the giant horses is on my yeah. bucket list. Definitely want to see them. When I've seen them on other people's YouTubes, I've just thought, oh, have yeah. to see them, have yeah. to see them. So, we, yes, what we're doing now is we're going to have a cup of tea, and a hot cross bun. Yes. You're going to do some editing, then we'll feed the dogs, probably feed ourselves. And then we'll have a walk up to see the uh, horses. horses. See the old Kelpies when it's dark. And I dare say we'll do a bit of filming. We've noticed with Jazz that whenever we're filming, she does something. She either whines or she scratches or she snores. There's always some kind of doggy noise going on. And we're getting the scratching today, aren't we, dear? <laughs> yeah, she's still going. So tonight, we're having chilli sing carne. It's made by Lidl's, and it's a one-pot meal. So even Graham needs a break in his editing, don't you, darling? I do. It's very good for a quick meal. A nice little bite to it, nice yeah. little kick to it. We both want to see the Kelpies lit up at night, so we're heading off up there now to have a look. It's about a kilometre's walk or something like that. As you approach the Kelpies, what really hits you is the sheer enormity of these wonderful, magnificent sculptures. They are, in fact, the largest equine sculptures in the whole of the world. And can't even these pictures just can't show you how huge they are and how fantastic they are.
I'm really pleased that we got to see the Kelpies. Graham's just taking some pictures of them horses. Awesome. And of course, the girls got to see the Kelpies as well. You wouldn't expect to hear anything else, would you? Jazz is very unimpressed at being tied to a fence. <laughs> Well, we're really pleased that we've been able to see the uh, Kelpies at night lit up. Uh, we're going to come back in the morning when the visitor centre is open and find out a lot more about these magnificent beasts. Thank you for watching. If you'd have enjoyed this vlog, please do consider giving us a thumbs up, liking and subscribing. It really does help us a lot with growing the channel and we really do appreciate your support.